Okay, rotator cuff all done. That's the top one. So that's been reconnected to the top of the humerus and a bicep tendosis or tendinesis. Um, so they cut that off and they stick it in your in a hole in your in your humerus and that's down there somewhere. Um, the full block is on. So they block you off by injecting anesthetic into your into the nerve that goes to your shoulder, which is cool because you get to watch that on the on the ultrasound screen. And yeah, that's quite interesting. And then it all goes numb. Bizarre. Uh, still numb, numb for about 12 hours apparently, but um, been advised to start taking painkillers pretty shortly. Well, before bed anyway. Um, and I've got a couple of follow-up physiotherapies and the, the way it's been done, I can start assisted movement after a couple of days and can finally get back to normal. Anyway, I'll keep you in touch. Bye. Patient in the front. Party pants in the back. Ew. I was admitted at 7.30 this morning and it's now 6 o'clock. Um, and this is me in my sling. Can't feel a thing at all. It's, uh, it's been blocked, so it's paralysed and uh, uh, I can just move my fingers now, but um, I'm being sent home with a selection of ibuprofen, cocodamol and tramadol. And they say take the tramadol before bed uh, or else you'll wake up when the block starts to wear off. Wish me luck. right on your stitch oh is that okay yeah oh bubby look at your little full skin okay yeah oh they have they have stuck it right over the stitch oh gosh look well, maybe work your way towards the stitch here but keep your finger no. on the on my skin 
Is that when you... Okay? Yeah. Okay, right, I'm right on it now. Oh, fuck. I'm just going to have to close it. Wow, one, two.